So standing out to the very exquisite Hyde sign shop in the Bay Pride Mall at Cochin. And the good thing about this shop is that it's all 100% leather. So it's all bags and belts and uh, lots of leather products. So come take a look with me. Like I was saying before, it's all leather products, it's 100% leather and it's all cow leather as I'm made to understand. Um, different stuff, some really beautiful bags around here. Again, that's, that's a very nice bag, I mean I'm partial to big bags and this one is a quilted leather and um, it's all done in vegetable dye so that green that you see is like a vegetable dye so you know the quality is going to last and the bag is going to be that much more durable. Um, Lots of other interesting um, bags around here. It's slightly smaller, but it's still big enough for me to like. Um, and that's something called an ostrich pattern, which is fairly new in the market. And um, other interesting details, details on the bag as well. Um, we've got like, lots of little stitching going on, some wooden beads. Um, they've even got a line of garments here. Lots of um, leather jackets. Obviously something like this would be too hot to wear uh, for our kind of weather. But if you're traveling somewhere cold, um, this is a good bet. It's a lovely suede coat with some shell buttons and completely lined uh, in a satin fabric. Okay, let's just try one out just to get an idea of how these look. Again, something like this. I'm already feeling hot in it. Not too hot because it's AC in here. So it's a very snug fit. I think maybe I'm trying on a size too small. But it's a lovely length, the coat, and nice shape. So next time you're traveling somewhere cold. Interesting colors around here that you don't normally find in leather. Like that's almost like a pista green shade. And it's got an old, worn out, um, used look about it because it's got like a different tone around the seams. And the lining is also in a nice um, slub fabric, so there's like a texture to the inside as well. Another fabulous piece here. It's a lovely burgundy coloured handbag and it's got like a crocodile skin finish on it. Um, it's nice when there's a diff different sort of texture on the leather because uh, without having to add a print or anything. So these sort of finish that makes it look like a crocodile skin uh, leathers. See another very cute piece over here. It's a lime green um, leather bag with the same crocodile finish. And um, even though it's a nice bright green, it's a very uh, rare color to see in leather. It's still. Um, a natural vegetable dye, so it's all good. Um, we've even got some matching wallet and a matching little change pouch to go with it. So it's all very, very cute. So you're completely color coordinated and perfectly accessorized. And uh, if you're going to get something like that, don't worry too much that, oh, you have to have like a green uh, outfit to match with it. You can even wear that with like a completely different color and have just that green bag as a contrasting accessory and it'll still look awesome. We've got some more accessories here, like we've got little wallets and uh, purses. They're all very, very, very nice. You can see that the um, quality of the products are of a very high standard. Um, the construction, all the stitches have been done so neatly and uh, probably looking at it, you can see that this is going to last you for a very long time. Got lots of cute little things over here. We've even got a leather file for the executive person. Let's see what all it's got in there. Ah, got lots, lots of partitions in there for your papers and files and stuff. Now, around the back of this, there's some lovely belts which I saw earlier. So we're going to take a look at that as well. So these are the belts. Um, as you can see, there's quite a lot of these very posh, classic sort of. Um, leather belts in brown and black so I guess you could wear them with your trousers. Um, we've also got the ones with some design so that's um, leather mixed with suede. Um, suede is also leather it's just that it's got like a hairy appearance. We've even got some very nice ones with some crocodile finish. We've got belts with a little bit of 
rhinestones on it. I guess these are for the women. These belts are nice because they don't really have a um, hole for the buckle. Uh, you just pop it in wherever, so it's like one size fits all. Now, there's something down here which is absolutely fabulous and you must not miss it. And those are your travel bags in leather. How really cool is that? I mean, I would, I can just imagine myself going traveling and packing all my stuff in this and feeling so great and uh, so completely posh. It's a beautiful brown leather bag and it's big enough to carry, uh, you know, for a overnight trip or something like that. I bet if someone saw someone carrying this bag, they'd be like, oh, she's rich, or oh, he's rich. Yes, being pure leather, it is quite on the expensive side. This bag would cost you 6,945 bucks. But I still think it's a very cool bag. And I love the color of the leather. It's very natural. Well, we've got some more lovely pieces out here and uh, look at the colors, they're fabulous. I'm just loving this yellowy orange color over here. And like I said, I'm always partial to big bags, so I just find this bag amazing. Just imagine the amount of stuff you can carry in this bag. There's also this lovely bright blue bag. Uh, don't be thrown by the color, this is still pure leather and um, purely vegetable dyed. It's um, really nice to see such bright acidic colors in leather because it's usually boring to see just brown and black leather. So something like this is very young, very funky uh, and also very, very trendy. You have bags of different shapes here as well. So if you're not, I mean, if you're unlike me, if you like smaller bags, um, you've even got options for them. Quite handy actually. And we have here a little special corner for uh, those of you who didn't like anything in the store, which I doubt. But here you actually have different swatches of leather and in different colors and different textures. So you've even got like embossed leather, which is quite interesting to see actually. Check this out. It's got like a little leaf pattern going around it. So you could probably pick a shape that you've liked um, in the shop. Like you could probably say, and apparently these are the things that go into making the beautiful bags you see here. So you have the different material that they use to tan the leather and you also see the handcrafted uh, sort of brass links that they use to make the buckles that go into the bags. So up here we have a little office section with lots of um, office bags and things that you could take to work with you. Um, you could probably fit your laptop in here or your other paperwork and files and folders. I think it's very, very smart. And I think this piece is adorable. Something like this you could probably take to college with you. Um, and just like your uh, little college satchels. You could probably get a lot of your books in there. Since it's raining, you could probably get your umbrella in there. Obviously, it's all lined, so you don't have to be afraid of spoiling your leather bag. I think this one is really, really cool. Awesome leather jackets over here. I have to show you. These are like so cool. Um, the leather itself has got a very vintage sort of appearance, um, very used sort of look. And the inside has got this lovely Japanese painting, uh, at least a painting of a Japanese woman. So I call it Japanese painting. And I really like the color, it's very unique. Of course, again, the question would be where would you wear it to? That one's got some color inside, and that's still very cool. Again, and it's got the pleat on the back, with some brevets and everything. Again, another very cool biker jacket. This was such a cute little shop, and um, Hyde Sign is uh, quite a popular brand all across India. It's got some 40 stores across the country, and it's even got some stores abroad. So I'm sure it'll be very easy for you to find a Hyde Sign store near you. Um, it, it's very, it's very, very sweet stuff if you're into leather. Um, very nice bags. I especially love the bags. Um, I'm only a little disappointed they don't do shoes here because I would have definitely come to buy some of them. Anyways, till next week, this is Tata. My life is gonna be